humans. Hopefully, not too much. Uh oh, fun factor. No skills. So that's all right, isn't it? Oh, could I get um anything for ninety? Because they've got a shitty little star. Nearly, they've got a hundred and ten helmet. Nearly could have got him. Could get um a reserve or a bay. Bay is probably less likely to have an effect than a reserve, isn't it? My balls on stream. No, it's my my chin actually, chili popper. <laughs> my chin. And I'm not from Men in Black. I'm not a ball chinian. <laughs> um, yeah, put it in the middle. Yeah, the old grows it's the middle guy. Oh, ah, oh, well, he's got he's got um. Got to show hands anyway. If anything, this just makes my recovery from him harder. Rain's probably bad, I would say. Poor TV. For vamps with no skills. Kicking, wise choice. Maybe lemon is good, maybe, yeah. Hello, I'm beautiful days. You could get, you can get one or zero. Um, you know. He's got, um, definitely not two, but you can have one for the strength three sure hands. Um, it's not bad. But obviously you've got movement nine dudes with agility four who make pretty good ball handlers. <laughs> Flashlight. <laughs> you should have a, what you should have, Tony, is a. Uh, <laughs> is a is a doll and a <laughs> like Tony P doll and then Tony P for China. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah, that's true. I don't. Yeah, it's it's not it's not it's not bad to have a thrower. Yeah, it's not bad. Shawnee flashlights. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh god, irrelevant swap. So I've been back there in case it kind of fucks up. China or all yeah. I could couldn't I? I could have Jim for China. Right, so we want to go there so we can eat him. Punch things. Put 
such things. Oh yeah, pick the ball up. What a fucking baller. <laughs> For fuck's sake, Tony! Stop being shit! <laughs> the one. Panzer Maddle's getting banged on here. Nothing more standard than making four knockdowns for no AV break. In the opponent making not one knockdown for an AV break. But you know. I'm not bitter. I was a little bit taller, I tell you. <laughs> are you sorry you started it? Why are you why would you be sorry? Right, so he could blitz and then come in there, he could come in there, he could two D him, he's free, he two D's him, he do tease him, he two D's him, and everyone's fucking happy. All right. Kick his face off. Glorious. <laughs> Imagine getting banged on by a fucking thrall. The block dice this game have been outrageously good, haven't they? Just quietly. Crikey. I can't believe it. Who's 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 playing who who's playing without my knowledge and rolling pals on every block? Literally every block thus far has been a pal still. Um how many is that? Three, four, five, nine nine out of nine blocks have been pals. <laughs> yeah, done exactly. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, they're still on the throw. It was pretty annoying. I mean, even though I know I'm on the seven, he's armor. I did get four knockdowns and did nothing. But yeah, this turn made up for it, didn't it? It got five knockdowns and uh, two kills and two stuns. But I mean, that's the thing. Blood Bowl's just so... There's so much variance, isn't there? It's crazy. Hello, Zungo. Um, yeah, could have gone Ogres. But, um, you know, Vampires are, are way, 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 way better than Ogres. Maybe not infinitely better, but approaching infinitely better.
shit in door for a vampire. Don't take the bomber on Goblin's Chili Popper. <laughs> so. Three, four, five, six, seven. So this this will be a, this is a two D and a three D, which is pretty good, isn't it? Oh, didn't roll a pal. Fucking outrageous. Never lucky, I tell you. Can chain him into him for initial block. Yeah. Not bad, is it? him and yeah, no, that gets both guys freed up might as well re-roll it eh? five Casual safe moves last? Well, why not, eh? Why not? Safe moves at some point. <laughs> safe moves whenever. I just realised this is probably a bit bad because he's going to... Um, He's gonna blitz that vamp, isn't he? Hit him with mighty blow. Cause I should have realized he was gonna base the ball at all costs. Yeah. <laughs> um Could put a guy in here and then 2D him and then 2D him and then 2D him and then blitz him. Alright. I feel bloodlust, that's the question. I guess here. Should have put it there, shouldn't I? Don't know why I didn't. I hear you, don't I? I think I do.
Yes, Chuff. Yes, four rerolls, four vans, and no bench. Yep, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, save me first sometimes. Oh man. He's giving up a lot of blocks here, isn't he? But no, it's not that good. Oh, you can't. Proper annoying. He could punch him, I guess, and keep people occupied. He could, like, blitz him and then assist there. And then he could block. He could blitz. There he is. Assist could come in here. A little bit of a fucking ball here, isn't it? I'm gonna keep the ogre tied up. Need the rear on the hit, don't I? Stunned fucker. Keep him stunned, prick. <laughs> These these block guys have been outrageously good, haven't they? Just quietly. Um, do I even need this guy here? Probably not, because there's a screen here, isn't there? This guy could come out. GFI gaze him or something. Could activate him to go one across, it doesn't really make a lot of difference, does it? Oh, could block him, got the reroll. I like how I instinctively didn't reroll that hypno gaze, even though it just couldn't have um couldn't have failed. But yeah, didn't think of making that block first. Audrey. Cook your snails and vegetables, man. Jeebus. No bloodlust, just uh, one bloodlust. I didn't activate them quite a few times. I'll try to activate them as little as possible. Ah, oh, well done, Drick, well done. Congrats.
Putting him one across last turn would have been pretty good. One, two, three, four, five, six, but then he's there. Could do a GSI or something. Yeah, this is kind of more. He likes getting punched, doesn't he, this guy? He really likes setting up all of his men to just get fucking punched in the face. He's lucky to have only taken two kills, really. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, push him to there. Three, four, five, six. Touch him away, but then he's one, two, three, four, five, six. He has a GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI to there. That doesn't look good, does it? I mean, having a GFI just fucking sucks, basically. Block this first and see what happens. Yeah, not bad. <laughs> yeah, it's not a bad kit, is it? He could just blitz there and then push him to there. Push him to there. And that frees him if it's a pal. One, two, three, four, five, six, five, six. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, GFI. That's a dodge, fuck. One, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe even without the GFI. So I've got to do the blitz first, haven't I? See what happens. Get the pal. So definitely pushing him there is the best one. That frees him up. And the way there. One, two, three, four, five, six. He wants to be able to bite someone. Which could be him. I should have stood him up first. Safe move sometimes. Probably should have pushed him into the arch and got another block, but it's a little bit risky, isn't it? Because I could have gazed him and then moved him out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, G five. Not easy, is it? Let him get smashed by an ogre. Seems good. For the next gimmick team, Jimmy says secretly is. <laughs> Nah, I don't think so. I just think maybe because vampires are bad, I think a little bit more than normal. Same as Brett's, isn't it? And Ogres, because they're so, like, because Ogres are horrific, I've got to try. Um, because Brett's are bad, I try a bit, and then because Vamps are bad, I try a bit. Yeah, I quite like the kit. I think, I think the kit's much better than, the, uh, than, than the, just the referee one. Much better.
best play his best play is the four plus dodge in um, uphill. So maybe I should have uh, this fam should have gone here, gazed him, and then moved him to there. I think that would have been the play rather than doing the safe move of the stand up. But then if I hadn't done the stand up, it, it, yeah, if I just hadn't done the safe move of the stand up, then this guy could have just come through without any rolls, could he? So. Good question, I mean it's good. I would say Underworld probably better, uh, better for Champ's ladder because you can have the claw pom and that. But Vamp's probably better for the playoffs because they're better at high TV, I would say. Obviously, Vamps can get banged on pretty well, pretty easily. He's doing the ogre dodge. Holy shit. One dice, power removal. Into ogre. Ogre blitz, fuck. Which again, I could have stopped if I'd gazed him and then moved him in. Oh well. Me punished for making safe moves first, there you go. That's why Fash isn't always right, is he? Because... The safe move first left me a bit exposed down that side. As if I'd done the vamp, gazed him, he could have totally shored that up. For fuck's sake, Tony! Stop being shit! Now oh, it looks like I'm fucked in it. Yeah, I mean, it was right. It was right to gaze him and then move him if the gaze worked. But I didn't. I made safe moves. Meanwhile, he won dices and dodges with loners and makes kills in every block, and it suddenly gets tough, doesn't it? Suddenly gets tough. Thanks to him rolling, rolling dice like a fucking god. I'm gonna blitz him, get a ball bounce, see what happens. Should have moved in there. Throw out first, but then I couldn't really with him being there. Double GFI at the end to pick it up. He could go one, two, three, four. Gears.
we'll just go for vamp heroics. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> GFI. Seems pretty stupid. One, two, three, four, five, six. Gears him. And it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Tempted to just score, really. So I can't stop him rolling dice, can I? She's got rain to rain to help with a two turn defence. <laughs> yeah, yeah, gaze is gaze is pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, conflict in them. Four. Use literally any other team, Waldix. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's uh that'd be my big tip for August. Um watch my games on YouTube. Which uh you know, did very well with August. <laughs> All right. Okay. But they were absolutely rock hard today. One, two, so three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, he's got to be the scoring threat, hasn't he? Clearly. Oh, I've just realised. I've just realised that I could fail the catch. <laughs> and it could be a touchback. So... Let's put these guys over there. Yeah, I, I didn't, you know, obviously I knew I could fail the catch, but I just didn't realise the, uh, the, um, what's it called, the touchback possibility until just then. One, two, uh, it's fuck it. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Fucking A. Just made it easier for him. Just made it fucking easier for him. If only, if only the ball had been here. For fuck's sake, Tony! 
Stop being shit! If only the kickoff had been there, then the failed catch would have still been completely protected and in scoring range and everything. Yeah, fan fox, yeah. Hey! Is it a block guy? Alright, well. <laughs> You're telling me there's a chance? <laughs> He's disconnected. <laughs> oh, God. I don't know who was the butterfingers. It was a don't. <laughs> Don't even need to work out how to hit this guy on three. I don't think I could have hit him on three. Just stand him up, face him, blitz him, and then fucking make some dodges and a pass. But obviously not going to get the chance now. No, he did re-roll Tony. He rolled double skull into uh, into bolt down. So it, it was a one in one in eighty one failure. Uh. <laughs> yeah, you did warn me about it, yeah, that's true. Oh my god, Azunga, that is, um, wow. Um... <laughs> Maybe you should go to the doctors. <laughs> Jesus. Um. <laughs> Soft conceit, no, just a, just a rage quit, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, Alpha from. Stay away from Skaven. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. This is uh, pretty strange. Play some cross out. <laughs> Panzer Metal, got to finish Panzer Metals, haven't I, to get Space Hulk Tactics? Oh man, I think Space Hulk, Space Hulk, Hulk Tactics, if they make it, a, you know, just exactly the same as the board games, would be pretty good. The problem is, um, I'm not sure it's that deep, really, Space Hulk. Um, you know, not certainly not as good as Blood Bowl. Um, Well, I think you've just answered it as Ungo. Yeah, I mean, he could have still easily made it 1 1, couldn't he? Or, or more. I mean, yeah, maybe, he'd, maybe he'd be 2 0 behind, but still. Um, yeah, it's interesting. It's interesting, Space Hulk. It's like, it's a cool game. It's a cool board game, but I'm not sure it'll have the replayability of, um, of Blood Bowl, even if it is good. Um. You know, just because you don't, you don't have the advancement, which is what makes, what makes Blood Bowl so good, and so like the longevity of Blood Bowl is is the advancements, isn't it? Um, yeah, action points to clear jam, yeah, yeah. Like it's just the same thing over and over and over again, isn't it? So I think it will get like, it's a good game, but I think it's not something you can play all the time. But um, we could certainly play it with like viewers and stuff. Um, pretty good, yeah. Gorkamo. I never played Gorkamoka to be honest. Yeah. 
Yeah, no matter how good they are, as humans will trump it. I'm pretty sure. As I say, I haven't lost. Um, I've ne I've ne I've won every single game of Space Hulk that I've pay played, whether I was the Gene Stealers or the or the Marines. I have won every single time. Um, you know, but I didn't play anyone who was any good. <laughs> um, I never played anyone who was any good at Space Hulk. Um, so you know, it's not really that. It's not that impressive. I won every game of Blood Bowl until I played somebody who knew how to play. <laughs> Using the most overpowered team ever. Mordheim was a really good, was a really good game, Mordheim. Really good game. Much, much better game than uh, Necromunda. But, um, but Necromunda obviously was way cooler. <laughs> That'd be pretty good, Hellboy. That'd be pretty good. I don't know about the computer game, but the the tabletop board game more time was was great. But then obviously that that had broken drawbacks as well. In the dwarf dwarf treasure hunters were completely ridiculously OP to death. <laughs> like they were so insanely overpowered, it wasn't even funny. Um, and. Your hand and knife was pretty overpowered. Skaven in general were ridiculously, ridiculously stupid. But then, so were like a million crossbows. Just, just humans with a million crossbows was the way forward. All right, good. Yeah, if if the Necromunda game was basically. Um, XCOM would be pretty good. Oh, brilliant. The Thrall, uh, the Thrall stole the MVP. That was good, wasn't it? Thrall only got MVP for his touchdown, though. That was alright. Level up. Block. Block mans. Can get another. Can go up to 13. Oh, no. Apo and Apo and reserve. Anybody want to be the reserve? Right. Um. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.